Morning, folks. Wanted to take a couple of minutes today to talk about uh, one very specific group of uh, people. In talking to a lot of people, the thing that we come back to again and again is that some people are saying, well, yeah, I can sell my house, but then what am I going to do? I can afford to buy another house or I can go deeper in debt. And, and that's a fair consideration. And each, each person has to weigh that out. But for some people, selling is a really good move. And we're talking here, perhaps, about those who have recently retired. Because retirement goes a long way toward changing what you need in a home. After all, when you are young, you've got a, a family, you may be looking at needing or more rooms in your home, uh, more bathrooms, a bigger yard, a place for the kids to play. Maybe you bought that place because it was close to a school you wanted your kids to go to. Uh, maybe you were one who found that you needed a home office. But now with the kids growing up and moving out, and perhaps with retirement, that office is no longer necessary, the extra rooms are no longer necessary, it's no longer needed to be close to that school, and frankly, that yard may be lovely, but it takes a lot of work that it's a little harder to do as we get older. That's all understood. And yet, your home may be one that has accumulated significant value. And that being the case, you may be able to sell that home and purchase something significantly smaller. Now, you're not alone if this is your situation. The number of people who have retired over the last year has far exceeded expectations. In fact, according to one survey, it's possible that 1.7 million extra people have retired in 2021 beyond what would normally be expected. These are people that they couldn't go into the office, they were working from home perhaps, they looked around and decided that this isn't really what they wanted. They have the finances, they don't need to continue working, and so they choose to retire. Now, having made that decision, they may look around and say, well, the house is just more than we need. And the fact is, according to some research, it seems that there may be an average of about $50,000 increased equity in each home. Now that's average, yours may be much more, it may be far less, but that's just over the last 12 months. So perhaps you bought your house when your family was young, you needed the space, you liked the location, but now you've retired. The kids have moved out and have their own place. They and their kids are not as close as you would like them to be. Can you sell your home, take advantage of the equity that you've acquired, and then purchase somewhere closer to the people you love. Well, you know your circumstances, and you know whether that's what you would like to do. Does it work out? Well, that involves looking at the market where you are and where you're looking to go to. It involves considering a whole lot of factors. And I would love to take the time to sit down with you and talk about what your needs are, how they've changed, what you would like to have now, where you would like to be, and how we can help you move toward achieving those goals. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me, area code 801-556-2259, 801-556-2259.